would be pretty today I'm gonna show you how we can create an instance on the AWS platform that is Amazon Web Services uh, I have created an account uh, with the free trial and a student account with the edu uh, AWS Educate so this is the console main console when you get their account approved so let, let's just click on this EC2 so now here click on this launch instance and you can see all the instances available here and you got to click whatever you want I'm going for you want to 16.4 LTS I'm going to select this now it's asking me to select the version you can either select medium large extra large and heavily heavy PCs but uh, I am going to currently go with the T2 micro it is also free tire eligible so uh, all the process processes for all this all are same uh, for this tutorial purposes I am going with the T2 micro so next I am going to configure and I am only going to configure one instance and all these settings will be the same I am not going to change anything I am ok with the Ohio US East server and uh, shutdown behavior will be I will go stop it say here and in here doesn't matter add storage the storage will be the same that is available with the sub machine that is 8 GB and uh, I'm not going to add tags I'm going to review and launch it so now this is the screen and uh, here this is the this is telling you to if you want to change anything you can change it here just click the launch then and uh, I'm going to use the existing key pair if you want to download any uh, if you if, if you're creating for the first time you have to create a new uh, new public key so you have to you will click here and whatever name you want name it and click on the download button I have it already so I am you going to use that launch instance here so now it will take I think a minute so view instances and this is the instance which I have just created now it's going it's uh, in pending that is initializing here so just wait for it I'm going to name it Saps tutorial tech so this is and it has initialized and now it's working so to connect uh, you you got to use the uh, putty putty is a platform which provides you and uh, SSH and telnet uh, connection it works as a client so you have to download it here I will attach this link in the description click on this download putty page and you will be directed to this page uh, not this actually this page so click on this download here, here and uh, select the version appropriate version for your operating system which you are currently using and uh, I have a have, have Windows and it's 64 bit, bit version so I have just downloaded this click on this you, have, you got to download this and then and yes you can see it's downloading I have done the downloading it and it's going to run it the setup is starting and next next I just now install it so yeah it's installed so now uh, so to connect with we have to start the putty here and uh, for the host name Copy it and paste it here and make sure your the port you are using is 22 
and the SSH is set as a connection type. So now go to this connection SSH and authorization, browse it, and go for your uh, authentication, your uh, key. Uh, let me direct uh, key. Yeah, here it is. So open it now, and it has yes, it's working for the first time. So it's asking you to either cache it or not. So I'm going to trust it for now. So connection is established, and it's asking me to enter the username to connect to. And the default username for Ubuntu VM is Ubuntu. So I am going to enter it. And yes, the connection is established as you can see. And I have the SSH connected. Just for the configured purposes, I am going to ping, uh, ping what? Ping, ping my website here. And yes, it's ping. It ha it's pinging to the side so I think that should be all for now and if you guys have any have any suggestions for what should I make for this tutorial here you can comment below and I will try to make sure I will try to uh, make a video on tutorials uh, on this further on so thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video and goodbye